Hi Taurus! Welcome to your love reading Taurus. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. What do we have for Taurus spirit? This is a collective message, collective love reading for your sign Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your situation. What do we have for Taurus? What do we have for Taurus spirit? You might be dealing with Aries. So what do we have? We have self-focused, career, such a flirt, loyal and love offer. Hmm, interesting. And this is a very dark card. Let me take a look. Harmony stable and we have Venus. Venus. You might be dealing here with someone who has stories in Venus, you know, displacement. Hmm. Taurus, um, this is someone who, um, who, who is coming with some sort of love offer. They're thinking about it. Uh, this person is, 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 is attached to you with the loyal card. It's like their heart belong to you. They, they heart belongs to you. But I'm getting that you dealt here or you're dealing with someone who likes others' attention. However, they want to reassure you here, Taurus, that they've always been loyal to you, that at the end of the day, you are the most important, stable, harmonious. This is someone who wants to bring some sort of offer of love that will bring more harmony and stability to the situation. But what I'm getting also, Taurus, is that you might be quite agitated. For some of you, you might be simply... simply frustrated or even angry with this person because uh, I feel that we are dealing here with someone who is very self-absorbed, quite selfish, self-focused and who might have uh, prioritized here career. We have a career card here, who prioritized something here over you. Let's see Taurus, let's see. What do we have for you? Can we can you please show us more about this situation? We have chariot. You might be dealing with cancer. This is a cancerian energy. So some sort of form of an action it's coming. That's your energy. This person wants to chase you, Taurus. You might be dealing with another Taurus. Oh my gosh, we have the lovers, Gemini energy, and we have a six of cups. Taurus, this person wants to reconcile with you big time. That's it. That's it. They want a higher level of commitment. This is someone who indeed wants to bring a love offer. Offer of a stable commitment. Six of Cups. This is someone who you've known, who you have a history with. Someone from the past. You will see how this person will, they will start chasing you because they do want a higher level of commitment. They want to be with you. Gosh, what else could you please show us? We have a six of pentacles. We have a five of swords. Mm -hmm. Show us more, please, for Taurus. Show us more for Taurus, please. Four of Pentacles. And we have Temperance, so this, uh, this harmony <laughs> that also is mentioned here. We have a High Priestess and Temperance. Okay, so what do we have at the bottom of the deck? We have eight of source i'm getting taurus that someone here at the time this person you might feel that they, that they played you with the six of pentacles and the five of source this is someone who might have played mind games with you 
you might felt that they again prioritize certain things they were giving to another situation therefore they focus they 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 focus wasn't directed only on you you know with the six of pentacles this is a pentacle energy so yes it might be a case that you dealt here with someone who was interested uh more in their career or they work finances something like this building their stability with the four of pentacles and i feel that at the end you felt being played that this person promised you something but they didn't deliver because five of swords is this energy of mind games mm -hmm. I feel for some of you also, you might have suspected that this person, um, again, uh, it's very secretive with the, with the high priestess. They have secrets, especially when it comes to their love life or some sort of relationships. Something like this is showing up. I feel that you were not fully sure of this person and you wanted just stability and harmony in this connection but this person was bringing some sort of mind games here it's like they you might felt that this person might be um entertaining something else or someone else because it's such a flirt right you might be suspecting again that this person was given to another situation and with the lovers and the high priestess you might felt that there was some someone else and with the five of swords and this person was playing mind games giving to another situation but i am getting strongly an individual who is very kind of 3d focused money stability work career overall someone indeed quite self-absorbed self-focused Mm -hmm. you might be dealing with Sagittarius I have Pisces energy and as I mentioned before there is a Cancerian energy there is another Taurus for some of you and Gemini energy eight of swords here at the bottom of the deck it's it, it it might be a case for some of you that you felt that this connection it's impossible for, it's impossible for this connection to be moved into the next level because of this person's uh, approach attitude but they are coming here Taurus this is someone who indeed you have history with they coming with an offer and for some of you it can be an offer of an apology please take it how it resonates but overall the intentions here are shown by the chariot the hierophant and the lovers it seems that this person really wants to be in a relationship with you Taurus Yeah, this person is invested someone who disconnected walked away it's coming back and they want stability that's essentially what they're showing could you please show me this person's feelings towards taurus could you please show me this person's feelings towards taurus could you please show me this person's feelings towards taurus ace of pentacles yeah they're coming with an offer this is a card of offer that card signifies offer <laughs> let's say it that way okay what else we have for taurus what else we have for taurus two of swords being at the crossroads not knowing how to approach nine of pentacles and four of swords mm-hmm This is someone who wants to come with an offer. They want to offer you like a, some sort of form of stability with this Ace of Pentacles, you know. But what I'm getting here, Taurus, is that this person is perfectly aware that they can't have their cake and eat it too. And you are dealing here with an individual who, who possess a very, very strong... Um, a strong sense of independence it might be a case that this person has been for a long time single you know or non-committal 
or they have casual or they had some sort of or they had some sort of casual relationships here with this nine of pentacles and this person here is at the crossroads because they know that in order to be taken seriously they need to resign from this lifestyle represented by the nine of pentacles they need to resign from it for of souls that has to just go away essentially this lifestyle but here is the thing the fact that they are at the crossroads means that this person is still attached to this uh, to 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 their habits you know this kind of being single kind of a attitude and energy <laughs> and do they do want relationship because this is a this is like a you know that represents relationship essentially hierophants to the to to the lovers higher level of commitment and they want this and they do want to make an offer here Taurus to you but this person still kind of the mindset because the thoughts uh, in tarot represents mindset logic you know uh, clarity this is someone who knows who knows that in order to come forward with an offer they need to resign from the, from their ways from that energy of being single and they are thinking about it because it's very difficult for some reason for this person to completely resign from this lifestyle but they do want to come with an offer this is also someone here Taurus who is assuming that um, you might not be fully open to receive this offer from them because they see you as someone here who is healing from this situation that's why they are quite unsure could you please show me how they see stories? Ten of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Could you please show me how this person sees Taurus? The world. Mm -hmm. Taurus, this person thinks the world of you. Two of Pentacles. Yeah. Eight of Wands, Three of Cups, Page of Swords. This person sees you as someone who is very curious, who is very social, who has so much energy, who is very happy, who, who just, who has this kind of natural, I don't know, there's something about you being very natural around people, that you are very likable here, Taurus very social also who can bring so much happiness to their life this person sees you as someone with whom they can build a solid long-term relationship with the ten of pentacles the world they think the world of you here taurus with the two of pentacles they sees you as someone who is very adaptable and very flexible very skillful you know and with this page of souls is someone who is very curious. I like this world here, how they see you. They think the world of you. Very nice. You might be dealing Taurus with another Taurus. I have Aquarius, I have Leo and I have Scorpio. Energy as well. So let's see, let's see. The outcome. Could you please show me the outcome with regards to this situation? Could you show me the outcome, please. With regards to this situation, we have a two of wands. Okay, three of swords and the sun. Of course, we have an ace of cups. Love offer. Like a double confirmation here, we have. Taurus, this person is planning. It's planning. And with the two of wands, I strongly feel that very soon they will make some sort of move. They will reach out and they will 
and make this uh, love offer. You will receive some sort of love offer here from this person and it can be a, an offer of apology, reconciliation, uh, commitment. With the three of swords to the sun, this is someone um, I'm getting, okay, as, as an outcome, I'm, I'm getting that this person is planning how to talk about this heartbreak or this separation or this, this, this emotional upheaval that they caused here, Taurus. But with the sun, it looks like you there is a possibility for both of you to reach a middle ground okay to 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 reach a, some sort of understanding and there is a chance for both of you to reconcile this is beautiful because the, it looks like this three of swords can be healed this person is aware that that in order to have this new beginning in love with you they need to talk and they need to face the music. They need to talk about and explain themselves about this free of swords energy that they caused, that they caused you. So uh, disappointment, sadness. This person might have even broke your heart. It is very subjective, of course, what this free of swords might represent to you. But I'm getting that huge disappointment and dissatisfaction. For, for some of you, emotional pain. But you can expect this person to indeed come with some sort of love offer because they do want to be with you, Taurus. They want a high level of commitment. You, 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 you might be dealing with Leo, with this son. But essentially, as an outcome, the cards are showing here that there will be a progress. We have a two, three, one, two, three. <laughs> it's like starting from scratch, you know, from, from the very beginning. This is someone who wants to have a new beginning in love with you, wants to be given another chance. And I'm getting here that indeed things can be different between the two of you because Sun, it's one of the most beautiful cards. It's always a wonderful omen to have Sun in a reading and especially uh, in an outcome. So there is a chance for both of you to heal this connection and to have this new beginning in love. Taurus, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly appreciate you. Taurus, have a fantastic and wonderful day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. Take care. Bye.